Hey guys, welcome back. It's your drinks a lot, and I have a special Halloween episode for you. It's a okay. It's not. It's not technically Halloween. It's a Mountain Dew Voodoo, a mystery edition, the 2021, or a mystery mystery soda, but the 2021 edition. So yeah, that's pretty cool, huh, right? So, uh, yeah, take a look. Yeah, see? Mystery flavor, voodoo with a question mark. 270 calories, you see all the little fun stuff there? Yeah. 90 milligrams sodium, 74 grams of carbs, or 73 from sugars. This is a 270 calorie bottle. Uh, caffeine is 91 milligrams. So, uh, let's give this a shot. This seems kind of kind of neat. Mm. It's kind of a. I'm not one of those people who like bites into a piece of meat that's been seasoned and they go, "Oh, this was smoked and uh, then seasoned with." Yeah, no. I, this the berry is very familiar. It's very sweet. I, I want to say it's a, it's kind of it's like a grape berry of some kind, but it's also it has a it tastes like a bit of a it's a it's almost a coconut were a grape. citrusy lemon kind of get to it you know <coughs> yeah I'd, I'd say I'd say I like, I like the idea of like a sweet lemon not like a lemon drop but in that same same vein where it's like it's got the carbonation gives you a bit of the pucker, but it's got <coughs> it's got its own bite to it. There's a there is a there is a grape uh, that I've had before. It has really really big uh, seeds in it. Usually about four of them. It's a, and I think it's in kind of I think it's a green grape. Um, I can't tell if it's a special type. I think it's the okay the big green grapes with the seeds in them. Um, this is what they taste like. Um, Some where you like where you peel, you can peel the the skin off. But with like a limited bite to it. That's pretty good. I like that flavor um, a lot, actually. I mean, I would kind of want like, hey, Mountain Dew, make a drink, you know? Cause this is a nice flavor. Um, hey, I'm gonna give this a, I'm gonna give it a five. I think I'm gonna give it a nine on the ten scale. Not like super duper, but definitely an awesome drink. I am, you know, and of course, this is me trying to come off of a, I'm not coming off of a diet drink thing, but I am coming it's the point where it's like okay here's what I want to do is I want to I've, I've been doing uh, zero sugar stuff for about for about a month now um, but it's not including uh, it's like um, I have like I'll get like watermelon spears and those are kind of like a little snack you know occasionally um, and uh, I've been trying to keep my foods down to like a like a turkey wrap set out that I'll that I'll make at home, um, but you know occasionally eat out, get some chicken nuggies, you know, but uh, 
definitely get like all my drinks and taking it like all the sodas. I've been I've been trying to do diet or zero sugar, which aspartame's not all that great, and people kind of get a little bit of weird when it comes to artificial sweeteners. But um, that's what that's what I've been doing, and that's I said it's been it's been fine. I haven't really noticed anything. Um, really um, but yeah so this is this and then the Fago I had the other day which like I said this is kind of my reviews are probably the only times I'm going to try to drink something you know sugary especially with the high fructose corn syrup I chug it um but I like I like the flavor. I do. It's a mystery flavor. Only come. It's only limited edition to 2021. You guys should try it out. Tell me what you think. As always, I'm Sir Drinks a lot, and I'm wishing you health, wealth, and love with enough time and gusto to enjoy it all, down to the last drop. I hope you guys are having a good time. I hope you guys are enjoying this season. I hope it is cool wherever you're at. The sun is shining, but there are clouds in the sky. The wind is blowing a little bit just to keep it a little cool, and you are all happy and healthy. So, see you later.